Here are two easy cipher setups on Pearl. Let's start on the A site. Get a trip bar right here. Another trip bar right here. Smoke right here. Hammer right here. And a secondary smoke right here. Then simply place yourself into this cubby and hop onto your camera. When you see people start to execute on the day's site, you can hop off of your camera and prepare to wallbang either this wall or this wall right here. If they trigger this tripwire, wallbang like so. And if they trigger this tripwire, wallbang like so. If you notice that there are people pushing through mid, or if people pushing from A main has already made it into around this location, activate your one-way cage, pop out, and get a free kill here, as the people pushing here cannot see you at all. This cage, again, is to prevent people from pushing into back site, or alternatively, you can use this to position yourself into CT if you're facing a lot of pressure, or if people are trying to wallbang you back uh, in the cubby there. For the B site, make your way up on the heaven, on the side of this ledge, put a camera right here, tripwire right here, a one-way cage like so, and a secondary cage like so. Now once the round starts, put a tripwire really quickly here, and make your way into back site. Hop onto your camera. And this is a fantastic camera because it allows you to see into mid and it also allows you to see the entrance into B. Now there are two possible scenarios. The first is that they trip this tripwire. If so, cage activate trigger. your cage, peek out, and get a free kill. If on your camera that you've seen people push just yeah. past the pillar around this location, then activate both of your cages, cage trigger. peek out, and you can see how there's a one-way effect right here for a free kill. Hopefully you've gotten one or two picks, and then you can simply play back sight, hold back sight, and wait for your team to rotate. In fact, with this cage, you can even play into this location, and you can see how there's also a one-way effect here. So it just really depends on how you want to play it, but there's a lot of options for Cypher. Here are some bonus cameras for Cypher on attack. Make your way onto this wooden box, stand on this corner, jump, and place a camera right here. This camera allows you to see into A plaza, top mid, double doors, and it basically prevents your team from being flanked through mid. There's a secondary camera here. Now, if you're on low graphics, you need a bit of a lineup to get this camera. So place your crosshair around the third tile here and move your crosshair to the height around the first tile. So it should be around here somewhere. Don't need to be super exact. Jump and place a camera like so. This camera allows you to get very early information into A art, allows you to see the plaza, top mid, and shops as well. So you can see for this camera, it's actually dependent on your uh, video quality. So if your detail quality is either medium or high, you can see how this camera is actually on the front side of the satellite dish, like so. This is a fantastic camera. It doesn't really get shot out. And uh, yeah, it gives you so much information into mid. 